This week's feast... Caitlin's Cupcake from Arcane. Okay, feasters, if you haven't seen Arcane yet, then you're seriously missing out. In my opinion, this is currently the number one best show based on a video game ever. And I'm not kidding. You don't even need to know a thing about League of Legends to enjoy it. But if you do know a thing or two about League, you know that our dear officer Caitlyn has a signature ability called the Yordle Snap Trap, and in the middle is one delicious cupcake. You might also link together that in Arcane, Vi always calls Caitlyn Cupcake. You're hot, Cupcake. <gasps> Their whole interaction is like, whoo-hoo! If you ain't shipping this, then you might need to get some things rewired in the old noggin. There also is a unique moment in the final episode of the show where we get a glimpse of a special cupcake with frosting and a Hextech gem on it. So today we're making Caitlyn's Thirst Trap, or Yordle Snap Trap Cupcake. It is packed with flavor, specifically Earl Grey Tea. We're infusing milk with it over high heat, stirring and removing it the moment it hits a boil so it can steep for about 20 minutes. In a separate bowl, combine your flour, baking powder, and a pinch of salt, and rainbow whisk it up. In a stand mixer, cream together your butter and sugar on medium speed, stopping occasionally to scrape down the sides and making sure everything is incorporated. Keep going until the mixture is fluffy. Next, individually add your eggs to the mixture and keep scraping down the sides of the bowl as well as the paddle so that everything thoroughly gets evenly mixed up. Decrease the speed once the eggs are incorporated and slowly pour in half of the dry flour mix. The moment it's combined, scrape down the side and pour in the Earl Grey milk tea mix, but strain it so that it's just the liquid. Mix this together until combined, add in the remainder of the flour mixture and keep going until it is smooth. You definitely don't want to overmix it here though, so pay attention. Fill your cupcake liners until they're each about 3 quarters of the way full and bake in the oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 15 to 20 minutes. You can test whether they're ready by poking it with a toothpick or chopstick and if the utensil comes out clean, you're done. Set these aside to cool. Next, we'll be making the buttercream frosting to top the cupcakes. Whip butter in a mixer on medium speed until it is fluffy, then add in powdered sugar, lemon zest, and some food coloring slowly incorporate the lemon juice as well as it mixes. Now you're gonna be whipping this for a while, so you don't actually need to get the perfect color mix in there immediately. First, let the color take shape, then based on that, you can add in more and more red, bit by bit, until it reaches the pink hue that you're looking for. When you're done, use a piping bag and make some nice, even swirls on the top of your muffins. Start on the outside, but not all the way to the edge, and use even pressure on the bag to swirl it around the cupcake, circling inwards, and doubling the layers up from the outside in till it gets to the center and you make a little smooch at the top. Mwah. Then carefully place a maraschino cherry on top of each, and voila! Oh, You've got yourself a Yordle Snap Trap with a delicious cupcake inside. This cupcake is elegant, British-inspired, and has the makings of a perfectly balanced treat. Just be careful not to grab it if it's in the trap, because you'll find yourself staring down the hot shot herself. Now, if you're by, hey, maybe you got caught on purpose. Either way, you'll end up singing, Oh, oh, the misery. Everybody wants to be a cupcake treat. That's right, you can even make the arcane version of this dope cupcake with a Hextech gemstone to top it off. The full recipe on how to upgrade your cupcake is in the description below. And if you like this recipe, make sure you subscribe to the channel because we got more goodies coming your way. And hey, go watch Arcane already. It's awesome. Look at this. Wow. I hope you all enjoyed that amazing presentation of these cupcakes because I am so excited about this final product. Yeah, this is epic. This is an epic feast. So cool. And you can make this bear trap at home too. Yeah, so all of you League of Legends fans know that the cupcake was a big part of Caitlyn's kit, but it's also a big part of Arcane. And we happen to make the version you see in the show, as well as the one you see in the game. And they are both just, wow, stunning cupcakes. These may be some of the best cupcakes we've ever made in the show. Wow. Just saying. Bold statement. Bold Ten statement. years worth of cupcakes, and this might be the best one. It might huh? be, yeah. It's divinely inspired Arcane, one of the best shows of the year. Probably the best video game adaptation of all time. No joke, I can't think of a better one. Well, there's only one way to find out if this is the best cupcake of all time. Oh, that's true, we have to eat it. All right, <laughs> cheers, Ash. Cheers. Mmm. 
Oh yeah. Mm. That frosting is incredible. Wow. The Earl Grey. Shout out Katie Lung, voice of Caitlin, friend of the show. Wow. Very cool. Tastes wow. So good. Sorry we uh, reduced your culture to Earl Grey tea, but we thought it was only fitting. Mmm. It was definitely a good key ingredient, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, no kidding. Wow. Subscribe to the channel, hey, if you haven't already. Yeah. We've got lots of good things coming your way. We've had some banger recipes recently, and I'm really excited about everything that we've done in the last year. Yeah. This is great. You know what? If we have not enticed you to eat with your eyes first on this recipe, <laughs> then we might as well quit. <laughs> <laughs> it just is so pretty. Yeah, and with the bear great. trap, we nailed it. Both versions of cupcakes, so all you diehard arcade League of Legends fans mm -hmm, mm -hmm. will be all about yeah. this bad boy. This cupcake is so good, I want to keep eating it, but I also want to talk to you, the audience, and convince mm -hmm. you to make it yourself. And how cool is this little crystal gem on top? Shout out to our producer Kelly for another great recipe and execution. Guys, yes. true to the world of League of Legends, mm -hmm. for all you nerds out there yep. that are looking for accuracy in your piece of fiction ingredients. Hey. <laughs> Those are my kind of nerds. You will impress every single Arcane fan that you know and League of Legends fan if you bust something like this out because yeah. this is a one-of-a-kind, beautiful concoction. We kind of impressed ourselves here. <laughs> yeah, we actually went all out. We've never done that much uh, product reveal photography, so I hope you all enjoyed that. Maybe you'll see it on TikTok. Sometime. Yeah, <laughs> just uh, doing our job of leveling up Feast of Fiction for you guys because you guys deserve it. You've been here for Aww, 10 years. Thanks, that's right. If you guys decide to make it, please tag us, take At pictures. Beast of Fiction on all socials. That's right. We'd love to see it. Keep it civil. We'll see you in the DMs as well as the comments. And always make sure you leave a comment below. Let us know what recipe you want to see us make next on the show. Yep. And we'll see you next time. Peace. Bye. Bye.